Hey guys, welcome back to another video today. The Scarlet and Violet update for Pokemon Home has been uh, released and I'll be showing you how you can transfer from Pokemon Home to Scarlet and Violet and how you can transfer from Pokemon Scarlet and Violet to Pokemon Home. So firstly though, you obviously got to make sure you've, got, you've loaded up Pokemon Home and obviously you are on version 3.0.0 because that is the home version you need. And obviously once you've done that, you just need to... Um, Make sure you are uh, able to get in because sometimes you can, sometimes you can't. And they're still re-rolling the maintenance. Um, so just depending on when you see this video, you might be able to get in. You might not be um, able to. It just depends. But keep trying it throughout the day and you will get in. Now, so we'll get into that. You do not need premium for this. Premium will be ideal because you can get more Pokemon in. But you don't uh, need it at all. So uh, yeah, this is going to be transferring from home into Scarlet. And there'll be a timestamp on screen from Scarlet to home. So to do that, to move from Scarlet to Home to Scarlet and Violet, all you need to do is pick the game of your choice. Obviously Scarlet or Violet, but for the purpose of this, I'm going to be using Scarlet as it is my main copy. And I'm going to use a Pokemon that you cannot obtain just to show you that it is all done uh, properly. So we're going to use for this tutorial a Shiny Mewtwo from Pokemon Let's Go. So obviously I cut this as my first Shiny Legendary, so we're going to just transfer it in show you how to do it so what you need to do that is find the pokemon you are looking for obviously in my case it is the shiny mewtwo it's taking me a minute because i can't look uh, there it is shiny mewtwo we're gonna transfer it in just literally move it from the home box to the scarlet and violet box and it will say something about like moves and tms don't worry about that and it's literally as simple as that send it over to the box press save and then literally that is it it's taken from home into scarlet or Violet and then all you need to do then is quit out Pokemon home and then load up the copy of the game that you are willing to play once you've loaded into your chosen game obviously you just need to go into your box as that's what you put it in home and then voila as you can see the shiny Mewtwo is in the game as you can see on the bottom right it is shiny with my original trainer from let's go and it says it has to join me from the Kanto region so obviously that's how you can tell it's from Kanto just remember where you put it in your box Otherwise, you'll be spending ages finding it. But as you can see, though, it is a shiny Mewtwo in Scarlet and Violet, which you can't normally get without this home compatibility update. So, uh, yeah, that is how you basically you can transfer them in to Scarlet and Violet from Pokemon Home. Let's just send it into battle against the Mudbray. Just to get a decent little look at it. And, uh, yeah, no, it looks good. Um, obviously, the unnerved ability comes through. Um, because I think I had pressure and pressure is no longer an ability in this game. That's why I had the uh, error message um, I mean, that's basically what it is And if you were wondering because you didn't see it then as you can see it does still sparkle So uh, yeah, that is obviously how you can move Pokemon from home into Scarlet and Violet Now I'm going to show you how to move things from Scarlet and Violet into Pokemon home So obviously make sure you are um, updated to the game and all you need to do is is you don't even need to play Scarlet and Violet anymore so if you don't have it uh, for some reason then that's okay because it's through your save you can just transfer from Scarlet and Violet save to Pokemon Home without even needing to touch the game which is uh, pretty good because I know some people played the game finished it and now don't have it for whatever reason either they're bored or they just didn't like it or had to sell it and obviously they want to put their teams into home you can do that all you need to do is click on the Pokemon button and then click the desired game of your choice for this tutorial, we will be using Scarlet, because that is the game that I have uh, most of my Pokemon in. And then all you need to do, obviously, is, for example, if you didn't watch the first part of the video, we did transfer Mewtwo over in Scarlet and Violet. We just have to send it back. And to send it back, we just go up to the Pokemon in that box, and then uh, obviously go and put it into the home box. It's simple as that. I'll show you an actual Power Daemon, just so you can see um, it happening. Let's just use... Um, just put it somewhere else so I can just reorganize it later. Um, we'll put it in this one box here. And let's just move the shiny Sotoddle. And we'll just put it in here. And that is literally it. It's out of your game and then into the home thing. But I'm not going to put it in home because I don't need to uh, for now. But that's literally it. Put it in the home box on the left. And then press save. And then it is out of Scarlet and Violet and into home uh, where it is safe and locked into. But uh, yeah. It is a very, very simple way of doing it. I hope you guys did enjoy. There is a list of returning Pokemon, so let me know if yours has come in. Some Pokemon can be sent, some Pokemon can't. Unfortunately, that's just how it is. And obviously, um, 
every Inscarl and Violet can be put in home and can be transferred into different games if their Pokemon does appear in it as well. There's also some cool challenges that you can do as well. So basically, if you have Pikachu, you can send it to all the games, but if you have a Paul Me, you can't send it to the old ones. I made a video on that, so uh, yeah, that's it for me though. I hope you guys found this video enjoyable and useful. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you all in a little bit.